Is it a selfie? No, it's a video. Oh. <laughs> Cara, I think this is the first Kubota one I've gotten close to. It's a Kubota 430. Tractor, I wonder, I'll, yeah, I'll, look up. I'll remember that. Oh, I know what kind of tractor remember. it is. Nice. That's good. Oh, they look at the floor. So this is one of the first ones, I guess. Hey, Carl, what do you think this is for here? Go do, go do how tall this fall. How tall this fall? Let's find out. What tractor is this thing? These are pretty pumpkins. I don't know. Let's see what this little guy is. They're all Kubota, though. So, that, Carter, you said that was a 430, the one that we wrote on? Kubota 430? Is this a Kubota 2? It is. Yeah, it is a Kubota. It's a... L257. Pretty tractor. It's got four wheel drive. Yeah, this must be, this is an older one. I think this is from the 80s or 90s. This thing is sweet. Huh? It looks good. Four shifting. Key. Older one, yeah. It's pretty. Pretty tractor. So I don't know if they actually use this one, but there's the fuel tank. I'm guessing this is just for show, but and then this must be one of the other like rides that they have because they have another one down there too. But wait, you said this thing has up to three thousand RPM? Uh, three thousand RPM, twenty-three thousand three hundred twenty-eight miles an hour. Twenty hours on it. Hours on it. Wow, that's a good amount right there. And then here you got your turtle and then rabbit yeah, mode and you got your keys shifters and then different things for the gears and then you got your brakes things like that it's pretty nice let's see yeah i want to feel a seat did they add cushion oh yeah they did yeah otherwise it been very cold. let's see if the steering wheel actually somewhat is it it feels good. It feels sturdy. And then you have your... Where, this doesn't have signals, does it? This, you have your uh, triangle signal there. What's that one for? Warning? Caution? Uh... I think so, yeah. I think those are your hazards. I wonder... They work? No, probably not. I don't think you said, No, I don't think this has any lights to it. Let's see. <sighs> no, car. It has no lights on it. You guys are so cute. Alright, Kurt. Oh. It'd be hard to sit on this with two people, that's for sure. What? I don't need a wide a wide lens anymore. I can just do this. This is sweet. Good view from up here, too. And then here's regular. <laughs> yeah, that's probably the loader. And then the L30. Okay. I wonder what kind of... Is that awesome? What kind of mower is that connected to it? You know? It's got a, looks like a fork on it or something. Capacity of 2,500 pounds. Okay. How much do you think that one's worth? I don't even see what horsepower or anything it is. Huh. I'd say 15. Well, if this one's 30, that one's probably. 40 maybe. I'd say less. Why would it be more? This has a cab. That one's bigger though. It, it, it doesn't, the cab doesn't always matter. That looks like it has a bigger engine. To me it looks like it though at least. I don't know. Well, Put your arms around it. Go see what that one is. Yeah, let's see it. So this one is 1002. LA 1002. The serial number is 10398 for the serial number. I don't know if that matters a whole lot, but yeah, this one's definitely bigger. What do you think? Side by side. It's it's definitely bigger. Yeah, it's look a, how tall it stands up. Yeah, yeah it's got way bigger wi back wheels too. Yeah. yeah. See how the wheels are back. 
utility. Yeah, I would it's say. A, it also says, it says utility special right there. Utility special. I don't know how well you guys can see that, but yeah, it's there. That's pretty. It's a prettier one. It's a different engine. It's got pallet fork on it. On the other side it uses i think i don't think the other one used a hydraulics this one ha actually has hydraulics as you guys can see so they probably have to grease this here and i don't know it looks good okay this is a uh just a regular t zero turn mower it looks like i don't know if it actually goes that because of the tractor but it's pto'd doesn't look like it's hydraulic from the back here i can't tell no i think there maybe is, there is one hydraulic that moves it up and down maybe i don't know so you might be able if you come around this side it says right here like see right there utility special they might be able to see that better oh yeah there we go yep la 1002 kubota tractor that's nice this one actually probably runs so i'm not gonna mess with this but it's, it's nice i have my wide angle lens activated so and then here's regular so yeah i'm about i'm five foot nine and this is on a little hill so this isn't bad at all for it but it's nice i like it so this is just the down shop here those look like some good uh pickles there yeah capri suns and then these look good too the card these pies here these pie pieces like that looks like pumpkin there I don't know what that one is. Oh, that looks good. like maybe a chocolate mix. There's there. Goes they, there. they look. I don't know. They might be cheesecake. They are. They are. They are cheesecake. Okay. Um, the chocolate looking one that is a cappuccino. Cappuccino one. one. Okay. That's probably that one. Yeah. Yeah, that looks really, yeah, these all look really good. Wow. I don't know. Yeah, but that's legit pie right there, I think. Looks like that's actually pumpkin and stuff. Looks good. Bought it and so we have it, so it doesn't run out. Correct, yeah, so I bought two pieces of, um, two pieces of cheesecake. They are, what are those, cappuccino flavored. One for me, one for my stepdad. My stepdad loves that kind of stuff, so. He introduced me to cheesecake, so okay, I bought him a piece. Oh my gosh, that's sweet. They're it's they're like expensive an though. They're four time. bucks a Where slice, a piece. Oh, so I paid eight bucks for two of them. I couldn't believe it. Cappuccino. That sounds interesting. Yeah, I'm. I'm ex oh, it better be dang good if it's four dollars. I do not. You do not. Nope. Mountain Dew's my coffee. Okay. Do you drink tea? Do you like, or you just don't? Tea, I don't mind. Yes, like sweet tea and you know green tea, I like. Yeah. Yep. Feels good out here. The breeze. So we are here at another pumpkin patch. I guess it's supposed to be a lot bigger. They have a corn maze. So you guys can see right behind me. That's some tall, good corn. Find out what it's going to look like. Yeah, look here. So that's good corn. Yeah, look at this. I'm five foot nine. That's probably eight feet tall. That's good. I did. I tried. So there's about two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So that's eight. And then it's about that long. So there's probably, this might be, I don't know. I'm going to guess around 200 bushel corn. Look at that, guys. Look at all those pumpkins down there. That's crazy. And yes, that's the same. This is the corn where it was originally. This is cool. They got all these bells set up. They even got a bale slide over there. I'm going to go down that or later on. Because, you know. I'm still a kid. Well, no, but I am a kid at heart, guys. You guys know me by now. Those are absolutely gorgeous. Wow. You want me to get one? <laughs> These are beautiful. For for this pumpkin. Sixty pounds. Sixty dollars. This has to be 60. Let's see. Oh, it's six. It like a circumference. Is it you think it's 60 okay, inches all the way around? Yeah. That's a good size. I'm like, there's no way that's 60 pounds. That's maybe 30, 20, maybe. Check this out. There's probably like 
200 bales here, maybe. Just normal square bales. <laughs> All right, time to try this out. Oh, bumpy. <laughs> cushioning there, that's nice. <laughs> Climbing the rope car. I think this is the exact same height, I think, maybe. Bring both of these foot. It's a good view. Oh look, they got a baby one car too. There's the hayride. That's cool. Good view too of all the uh, little field there. That's probably two, maybe three acres at the most of corn. Check this out guys. Look at that. All categorized and stuff. That's really pretty. And then, of course, this is the area where many of them come here. Main ones. All right, guys, let's see what we got here. So this is pretty corn. So let's see, so there's 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30. So 30 by 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. So if you divide that in half, so that would be... So that would be roughly about 215 bushel corn. Let me take this and walk through this maze of corn here. Skid loader that dad's running. all leveled out so this year yeah i know you guys can't see it very well but this is a hill for where we're going to shoot at so we're going to set our targets up here and shoot and then there's another hill that you can't see that's right in front of you right now turn on your flag help. can i do that with the camera on how do i i think you have to restart the corner oh there we go so now you guys can kind of see the hills right here yeah that is here it is so this will be the side of it the side bit but so yeah this is a 30 horsepower really old uh skid loader so it works but i rode it my i drove it myself for a little bit it's a pain in the neck it doesn't have the foot pedals like you like you would use to for the arms and stuff um the way that you use it is just so different but it works he's tried oil in it and stuff it's got a bad leak in it underneath yeah so 
That's it leaking right there, the hydraulic fluid. Dusty out here. <laughs>